Warning, the following video is so manly that it can make a woman grow a beard. So if you are a little Justin Beaver, proceed with caution. What is up my fellow Beescribers, the massacre keeps going, this is, this is fucking insane, alright? So at this point, Infinite Warfare is a game that isn't even out yet, alright? But at this point, it is already on last stand, it's on the ground, you know, waving the white flag, begging for mercy, but... The Call of Duty community is not stopping, alright? The Call, the Call of Duty community at this point is very unhappy because this is not what they want, alright? This is not what the Call of Duty, the Call of Duty community wants, alright? Some of we say in the Call of Duty community that this is not even Call of Duty anymore. And others even say that, you know, I want a war game, not Avengers Age of Ultron. So, you know, what happens when the Call of Duty community is unhappy? Yeah, that's, that's what fucking happens. 2 million dislikes. In fact, over 2 million dislikes. For a lot of people, victory has been achieved, alright? People are celebrating, partying with their friends, and even asking for the outrageous amount of 3 million dislikes, right? 2 million isn't enough. They want more. They want to beat the shit out of Infinite Warfare until uh, they cannot dislike the fucking uh, game anymore, right? You know, even though I'm, I'm a little bit happy, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm I'm a little bit happy with the situation of Infinite Warfare getting so much fucking dislikes because it's, you know, I'm watching this trailer and even though it's not a multiplayer trailer, I'm like, bro, this is gonna be like Advanced Warfare, it's gonna be like Black Ops 3, this is gonna be bunny hopping and all that bullshit and I just want a classic Call of Duty. I don't mind it being in the future, I just want it to be fully uh, I, jo I just want to be boots on the ground right i just want the soldiers to be not normal soldiers and not fucking power rangers i'm not here trying to defend infinite warfare um i'm defending call of duty all right i'm unhappy with infinite warfare it's gonna have advanced movement and all that bullshit uh but uh, i'm defending call of duty as a franchise because i love call of duty that's all i play my channel is about call of duty and i want call of duty to be great every single year right um i'm not you know there's a few Call of Duty's I dislike, but I always buy them. I always give them a chance, even though I might like, I might not like what I see in the trailer. I'm still gonna buy the game and give it a chance. See, you know whether I like it or not. That's what I fucking do, all right? A lot of people are just killing Infinite Warfare at fucking birth or even before it's fucking born. Uh, but I'm still gonna buy Infinite Warfare, obviously because I also want Call of Duty 4 Remastered, so I have no fucking choice. Uh, but I'm gonna buy Infinite Warfare. I'm gonna play it and uh, I'll see it. Uh, I'll see if I if I will enjoy the game or not. So you know I'm not here. Sitting like a fat slob, you know, like a couch potato, just waiting for Call of Duty to fail, and as soon as it fails, I'm fucking happy, whatever. You know, I'm not happy when Call of Duty fails, because I want to enjoy all Call of Duties. As I said, I love Call of Duty. So, on today's video, and I apologize for my intros or whatever, I always ramble a lot before I get to the fucking point, but that's what I like doing, I like explaining my shit. And on today's video, I am bringing you five reasons of why I think everyone, millions of people, in fact, are hating on uh, Infinite Warfare. So, reason number one, Infinite Warfare has bunny hopping. So, Infinity Ward tweeted that the uh, movement system in Black in uh, Infinite Warfare is going to be similar to the movement system in Black Ops 3. Obviously, a lot of people are very unhappy with this situation because for the third year in a row, we are going to be playing Power Rangers in Call of Duty. Now, people who want to be bunny hopping and wall running and sliding all over the place like Power Rangers anymore people just want to be normal soldiers and that's why millions of people are hating on infinite warfare this is the main reason bunny hopping all right people just want the good old traditional boots on the ground because it's less chaotic it's more enjoyable just take black ops 3 for example the spawns are constantly flipping due to wall running due to the, the sliding and the bunny hopping the movement is too fast all right uh, there's always a motherfucker lurking in your spawn shooting you shooting you in your back and that is super annoying it's too chaotic and obviously people don't like that so this is uh, i believe the main reason of why Millions of people are hating on Infinite Warfare. Reason number two, it is a futuristic Call of Duty. Now, people just wanted to, you know, be normal soldiers. People just wanted to go back in time. World War One, World War Two, Vietnam, even modern warfare. But instead, 
they are playing uh, in outer space all right uh, they have like spaceships robots maybe laser guns maybe wave guns maybe even fucking clowns in infinite warfare and obviously people as i said they didn't want that so again this is another reason why people are hating on infinite warfare i mean since black ops 2 we have only been playing futuristic call of duties black ops 2 futuristic ghost futuristic advanced warfare futuristic um black ops 3 futuristic and now infinite warfare is also futuristic to be honest the one that is less futuristic is call of duty ghost but that happens to be the ugly duckling all right it happens to be the call of duty that people hate the most when it comes to these uh last five call of duties all right so uh reason number three call of duty 4 remastered can only be bought together with infinite warfare obviously there's millions of people that don't want to buy infinite warfare they don't even they don't even want to hear about that game you know that name infinite warfare causes them nausea it causes them vomits all right so just the thought all right of having to buy infinite warfare together with the precious with the masterpiece quality for remastered you know it probably almost gives them a heart attack because they know that you know Call of Duty 4 Remastered is going to be the, you know, is going to be the cause of success of Infinite Warfare. Only because of Call of Duty 4 Remastered, Infinite, War Infinite Warfare might be a success, alright? Because millions of people want to play the good old Call of Duty 4, alright? And they know that by buying the game, the sales of Infinite Warfare are going to be a success. Uh, even though that's that's a fucking lie because people don't want to buy infinite warfare most likely they're just they're just gonna throw infinite warfare in the garbage as soon as they install call of duty 4 remastered in their consoles so uh, and obviously what you know another thing that makes people super unhappy is the fact that this was a cheeky move by activision activision knew that uh, infinite warfare was going to suck all right that was not going to be well received and they were like man we gotta do something otherwise people are not gonna buy the fucking game all right so what did they do they decided to bundle call of duty 4 remastered together with infinite warfare that was a fucking masterpiece of a fucking move let me tell that right now activision uh reason number four the reason the fourth reason of why millions of people are hating on infinite warfare is because of battlefield one now what did battlefield one do well battlefield one pretty much didn't do anything all right you know i'm not i'm not hating on battlefield one let me say this right now i gotta be very clear with these people with you know most of these people watching these videos because they, they don't fucking understand what i'm saying and obviously i use sarcasm a lot of times so it kind of mind fucks them but you know i like battlefield all right so you know we're clear we good all right so i like battlefield one i'm gonna buy the fucking game let me tell that right now so you know uh, the call of duty fans were expecting a game back in world war ii world war one with boots on the ground but instead what they got was a fucking call of duty in space with spaceships and robots and fucking bunny hopping and so pretty much battlefield one a f you know a few days later uh releases a trailer uh, or we got the thrill of Battlefield 1 a few days later and it has what everyone wanted in the Call of Duty community it is a game it's a shooter with boots on the ground back in time in World War 1 so right there right there uh, it, you know it's like I think it's it it was like as a revenge it seems that most of the Call of Duty community liked the Battlefield 1 trailer pretty much as revenge because Infinite Warfare didn't give them what they wanted and the um, the competition gave him what they wanted dice you know battlefield usually call of duty and battlefield uh, don't go along together you know the fans but this time around battlefield one is so epic you know battlefield is so epic this year that the call of duty fans were like man this shit is good let's fucking like this trailer right um and i i think it was more as revenge all right that's my opinion because um there's no way um battlefield uh, is going to get 1 million likes on their trailer this just happened because infinite warfare sucks for millions of people 
and they used uh, Battlefield 1 as revenge, alright? And another master move by DICE was releasing Battlefield 1 a few days later, uh, Infinite Warfare. That was a fucking epic move, so people were hating on Infinite Warfare, and, you know, DICE was like, you know what, the competition is down, it's wounded, it's on the ground, let's use this moment as our advantage, and that's what they fucking did, and their trailer got millions of fucking likes. You know, that was a cool move, and finally, ladies and gentlemen, um, the last reason why Infinite Warfare is getting millions of dislikes and to be honest this reason might might not be uh, the biggest reason but it helped a little bit right it helped a little bit uh which is the dislike bandwagon it seems that at this point the cool thing to do is just to dislike the infinite warfare trailer is to hate on the game and uh, i mean there are even comments there are even comments on the trailer reveal of infinite warfare uh such as i didn't even watch the video but the trailer has so many dislikes that i had to dislike the video also something like that i saw the comment but i forgot to uh print screen it and that's pretty much what's happening you know little kids are like yo my god have you seen the infinite warfare trailer that has millions of dislikes man we gotta do the same let's all dislike the video let's see where we're let's see when it's gonna stop is it gonna reach three million four million whatever so people are like curious to see uh how far this can go and they're just disliking the video for fun all right because everyone is doing it so they want to they want to do the same and that's pretty much these are pretty much the five reasons ladies and gentlemen of why i think infinite warfare is getting so much fucking hate um and uh, let me know in the comment section below what you think and finally ladies and gentlemen before i go let me show you the comment question of the day the bogan hunters asks do you think the infinite warfare trailer deserves 1 million dislikes considering we haven't seen the multiplayer reveal or played the beta. Well, let me just tell this right now. Uh, probably already know it, but it has over 2 million dislikes. That's fucking insane. But I agree and I don't agree. I agree because this is the only way they're gonna know that, you know, this is the only way Activision is going to know that we're not happy with this situation, all right? We don't want to be Power Rangers for the third year in a row. Uh, we just want to be normal soldiers. Obviously, the trailer itself is not bad it looks good you know it's a campaign trailer it looks it looks fast paced it has a lot of action i fucking liked it all right the reason why everyone's hating on the trailer is not because of the trailer itself it is because it's gonna have bunny hopping and we're gonna be power rangers one more time if people were liking the trailer if people were liking the video because the trail looked good you know nothing was going to change and i'm pretty sure that next year we might not see uh, bunny hopping uh, again and that's pretty cool because we've we have been bunny hopping for two years in a row we're gonna be bunny hopping for a third year um con for a third consecutive year whatever and that fucking sucks but at the same time i'm like man you know this shit doesn't deserve all these fuck all these fucking dislikes because you know when infinity ward infinity ward made this fucking game because people were crying about ghosts all right so they did what you wanted you wanted another game you didn't want ghosts and they gave you another motherfucking game and back then the shit that was hot was bunny hopping due to sledgehammer everyone was super hyped you know oh my god we're gonna be boost jumping and whatever in you know exoskeletons in a uh, in fucking uh, advanced warfare oh it's gonna be epic so you know infinity ward um the what you motherfuckers wanted you wanted something different you wanted something new anything but fucking ghosts and that's what they give you they worked hard on this motherfucker and you know it sucks when you when you work hard on something and then everyone hates on it you know it sucks when i post a video i work hard on the motherfucker you know i, I was up till late um you know doing the uh, rendering whatever creating the video whatever editing the video there we go and then i post it and it gets no views or it gets a shit ton of dislikes i feel fucking bad so at this point they're probably feeling fucking bad because um 
they did what you fucking want and now they're getting fucking hate but uh, and another thing is we haven't played the game yet we don't know if the game's gonna be good or bad we haven't seen any multiplayer uh, gameplay and uh, you gotta keep in mind that this is infinity ward all right and they always have biblical hit detection in their game so right there that's a fucking win for me if this has the same hit detection that ghost had it's a fucking win because black ops 3 has a shitty ass hit detection um you know in ghost i shoot motherfuckers they die they have no chance they draw that in front of me in black ops 3 i shoot motherfuckers they turn around and kill me they make me feel like a bitch and i don't like that bullshit so that's why i don't play black ops 3 anymore because I, I, I just can't fucking take it so maybe the game's gonna be the game's gonna be fucking good and again as i said before if it has riot shields i'm fucking sold all right i'm fucking sold <laughs> so there you go ladies and gentlemen uh, i agree with the game getting so much this uh, getting so many dislikes because we don't want bunny hopping anymore and at the same time i don't agree because we haven't seen uh, the multiplayer gameplay yet and maybe maybe there's a you know there's a small chance it's going to be good but maybe it's going to be a good call duty so i hope you enjoyed this video um i will see you next time spartan beast peace out